Hey y'all, welcome back. Got two small trays. I think I might make this one a little bit too thin now I'm looking at it. But um, we're gonna unmold these. I'm not even gonna change camera angle because I've realized that I've made it so that my new workspace has enough space for me to do this right here. So let me get this here. We got a grinder and we got some incense holders over there. So this is just some leftover. Ooh yes you see how, oh look at me about to drop stuff you see how sharp these are like yes that's what we need it to be we got some bubbles in there but for the most part we got some sharp ones um probably gonna yep gonna pop this off so it doesn't end up in somebody's uh what you call it but yeah we got sharp edges that's what we're aiming for on those um these are for my vending oh yes 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 i got one that i gotta yep there we go and here we are so we got this red this little red grinder i'm gonna get i'm gonna make sure i get all these extra loose pieces together before obviously i bring them out to sell and we just drop this in here, twist, 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 and there we go. There we are. Yep. That's that. And ooh, we got this. Um, it's rainbow because, okay. Um, let's start from this side. This one. Oh, I didn't even realize this was a plain one. This one is plain, um, well not plain, but it's orange and yellow. Um, just a solid rounded edge incense holder. This came out really good. It's firm. I thought it was gonna be thin because it was um, a little bit thinner. I don't know if you can see the difference in how it slants a little bit. Yeah, you can kind of see the thickness gets thicker this way because oopsie on my behalf, but um, that just flopped. So here we are with red and blue. And these have, ooh, dang, that looks good. I think this is my first time actually like, I haven't made many of these incense holders, but this is my first time actually paying attention to make sure that um, the hole wasn't clogged <laughs> when I did it. So this came out really nice. Um, usually I've just been like drilling at them and like fixing it that way on the back end. But you know, I'm one of a preventative measure rather than a reparative measure type of girl. So here we are with our blue and red. Um, these in the middle here glow in the dark. So I'm gonna get us a nice picture with the glowing inserted here. But yes, we got blue and red and of course it's starting to look purple on the back because it's going through the color but it's definitely red and blue and it comes around on the side i'm going to smooth my edges off um before we put them up for sale and we are here with this purple and green it's definitely giving ninja turtle <laughs> um oh that came out great this came out really good. I really like this. Yes, this purple and green is giving what it was supposed to. Yes. Um, not sure if we got any glowing on these stars, um, but I will definitely check before I publish this to the website or bring them out to sell, whichever, just so I know what I actually did because I just be trying stuff to see what works. <laughs> um, but yeah this purple i love how vibrant this purple is and this green looks really good with it so there we are i'm gonna have to make a deeper hole for this one because i had some extra spillage on that one um this one spilled over a little bit i think i poured too much in the mold itself but here we are we got our three incense holders um and our grinder um my way back around here so yeah um ah get this out of the way but <laughs> don't look at that <laughs> so 
we bit this away. All right. <laughs> so yes, we have our incense holders and our grinder. Um, here we are. We get to see exactly, you know, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple. Yes, I know, very gay, but it's pretty. And the three packs are, um, they're sold as a three pack. So they will be available. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to put these on the website because I am doing a vendor event um, in a couple days. So if they are on the website, then let me say this. Uh, we're not going to put that out there. If they end up on the website, they end up on the website, but that's not the intention right now. Um, so yeah. Thank you for watching. Um, just like everything else we do at Pointless Talks, Pointless Creates, um, make sure you check out the website. Make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel. Make sure you listen to the podcast. Um, and just like everything else that we do here, whether you got here on purpose or by fate, thank you so much for watching this Pointless Unfolding. Bye.